Hi everyone, Nikki here, Smurfy161. So I'm really lucky, I've got some more friend happy mail from Jean Suko. She's um, very kindly sent me some magazine images and stuff. But she also included this lovely, let me just make sure I'm in frame, lovely stamped image of house, house mice, house mouse, oh I can't speak anymore. Haven't had a very good couple of days with headache and a buggy thing, so I'm feeling quite fragile, but I wanted to come on and show you this. So, um, yes, yeah, so that's a lovely image. So this would definitely be going in my um, Christmas daily journal, so I'm definitely going to be putting that in there. Let me just move the scissors, because otherwise they rattle and go. I'm going to move the bag. She, she always jam-packs stuff, so thank you very much again, Jean, for spoiling me. You're a real star. I'm not going to flip through these, because we'll be here for a little while. And I, like I said, I am feeling quite fragile, but this really cheered me up to get today. So she's included these magazines, so you can cut them out and keep them keep the ideas for layout. So I'm not going to be cutting these up. I'm actually going to be keeping them. So I can, if I'm stuck for a layout or something, I've got a few. So there's that one. They're all Christmassy themed, I think. And that one. I used to have that stamp set. <laughs> I keep looking at things thinking, oh, I used to have that. And then I got rid of it. And this one. I have. I used to have quite a few um, house mouse images. And then I had that big clear out. So I might get some more somewhere. And then another one. So those like magazines for ideas, which are great. And then we've got bags of little bits she's cut out for me. She's so good and she loves fussy cutting, so it's lovely. So these are the um, going on future projects. I have an idea. Um, I'm just, yeah, I'm paranoid, I'm not filming. I have an idea. I thought of it in the middle of the night when I wasn't actually sleeping. Um, but I'm going to make some journal cards and sell them on my Etsy. So, like, use these magazine images and things. So, we've got, like, a long Christmas border. So, that's definitely going in my, for my Junky Joe box because I'm always looking for borders to cover up little bits. And then we've got this long one. So I'm putting them in there now while I remember. Oh, there's another little bag there, so we'll do that one in a minute. So yeah, I thought that'd be quite fun to do like my own journal cards and um, see if I can sell them. They can also go as toppers and stuff. So, so I've got that image. So I'll do a couple together again, like I did. And then a little doggy and stuff. So she has, she's been cutting out for me, cute teddy bear, angel, and I've got a skinny Santa, <laughs> a bit of a skinny Santa, he's got very skinny legs, and I've got this image, yeah so um, she's really sweet, we've become sort of crafty pen friends, we sort of write back and forth every now and then. So yeah, so I'll have to do a page in my journal as well with this because I like to make a note of when I get something sort of thing. There's no card so I'll have to write a little note but um, I'll keep like some of my real image, favourite images out of this lot and put put in my Happy Harry journal. And we've got Snowman, Popcorn the Bear, I used to have that um as well. Sounds awful. I used to have that. And then I sort of, I got fed up with CD crafting because the ink was so expensive. And then Hunky Dory came about and I just love Hunky Dory stuff. So I've got Gingerbread House. Great big gingerbread man. Love that. So fun. And another one. Very cute Santa. And we've got like a thank you Christmas. That was that little bag. And bless her, she always puts it in little bags for me. She's so sweet. I do keep them and I reuse them for like storing some of my own things. Sorry, wrestling alert. <laughs> that little one doesn't want to come out. So we've got 
that image Christmas collection oh, got a couple of small ones here and then Magnolia Girls and yes I used to have some of them I've got some really cute little images on here and the Swalk ones which was Crafter's Companion so I'm just going to layer them on top I think and then we've got those ones that was a hung um that was a Kanban kit because I had that as well and I loved it made quite a few cards with that for charity uh, little girl kit giving love to a polar bear posting her letters so yeah you really are very kind to me, um, Jean. It's very sweet. So, little hedgehogs. I think the hedgehogs are um, penny black stamps, I think. Little mice. Little girly. So, I hope you're seeing everything okay. Got ink on me somehow. And then got a little bear. So the thicker cardstock would be great on little tags and things. I'm not. I was thinking of making Christmas journals to sell, but I just don't think I'm going to be able to with everything else going on. And some of these smaller images I've been putting in my cluster box, so they'd be quite fun to use. And we've got Joy, got this little flower, snowman, another Joy. Little Robin flowers, more little images, and that looks like Lily of the Valley. It does, and then that little one. So yeah, she's been so kind cutting all these out. And those are little rosettes, and then we've got that really sweet image, little penguin. Oh, that's so cute. So a crochet donkey, yeah, a donkey with a bauble. And put that on. And then some more little images. Flutterbys. Christmas. I don't know where you've got all these images from, because you only just sent here a lot, so you must have a really good stash so thank you so much for sharing with me again Jean it's really kind of you and I've got the ball balls and that so let's get another little bag I hope I'm not using up all your bags Jean because <laughs> you are so kind to do this it's really sweet of you Oops. got a landslide going on here so you'll definitely see these in future projects and things, I'm sure. So we've got these ones. We've got so some of these aren't all Christmassy. Some of these are like floral and things like that. I have missed some images, but <laughs> she's so kind. And my camera only does so long, so there's some like little borders in there. So I'm gonna pop them in that box because I like borders for there and then I've got that little border of cards these cute images I'm still on a huge craft ban for ages now <laughs> so I need to save up for the holiday in May we're going to have our family holiday I've got them and a little image there very pretty dress. I've got some cute little animals. Butterfly, oh lovely butterfly. So some of these are going to go in my animal journal as well. So cute kitty cat. Little corner. Another cute kitty. More corners. Another kitty cat. Forever as friends. Little something that's been painted doggy image Oops. and then we've got like a card sketch some flowers another card image I did so it's, these are great 
and another sort of flowery image some funky cups some flowers more flowers another card just get it up the right way some more little black and white images birdie some flowers uh, more butterflies cute bunny and a flower so lots of flowers and like a mosaic design and we've got a card sketch and another one Oops. no flower there <laughs> see she does spoil me she's so sweet so um she lives in liverpool so um yeah, it's really sweet to have a U UK crafter to um, sort of write back and forth to. So I've got these little sort of collage image, paper clips. So, so another little border, and so that's another border. Right. So yeah, I like to use these in my Junkie Joe book just to cover up the little images, edges. And we've got that, another little... So yeah, she's really spoilt me. Oh, that would be fun in Junkie Joe. When I call it Junkie Joe, it doesn't mean I think what she's given me is junk, because I certainly don't. It's all really sweet, lovely images she's given me. So um, it's definitely going to keep me out of mischief for quite a while and then there's some more board strips there so yeah she's um thoroughly spoiled me well whoever's if anybody sends me mail i always feel thoroughly spoiled i think it's nice when you know i've done random acts and things and know how much it's meant to the person and what have you so i've got another border of images there Another one. So Junkie Joe is going to be really well off on um, borders, looking very glam with all these. And that one. And then we've got all these cutouts. And another like border thing. The stars. The craft band. Haven't I think they've closed down? I'm not sure now. News track. Yeah, so she's cut out like the flowers and corners of magazines, which is lovely. Very nice when you want to fill up a spot on something. So I have like a corner and so these paper samples, little girl with the kitty cats. Flower, um, no butterfly, I mean, part of a butterfly. Another corner, another flower and that, so that's that little bear. And then we're on to this one. Sorry, my voice is getting a bit dry, so apologies if you can't hear me too well. And then we've got this. So obviously decorating a box. That looks like a tonic die card. Cute baby. I love that. That's so sweet. And a flower card image. Yeah, I must do something like that with my doilies. I've got some. And then I've got this gorgeous dress, fabric. So you must, yeah, I know you sew because you make such gorgeous bags you've given me and my mum. So you must buy sewing books as well as card making. And we've got a cute kitty. And all these card ideas. And another one, threading through. I used to have eyelets set and then I sort of given up with it. And then we've got that one. And then we're on the last little bag. So I don't know. Craft with Helix. Designed by crafters for crafters. So I'm not sure if this is something brand new. If it is, it's very naughty to send me that. But I really do appreciate it. So yeah, I'm not sure. Let me have a look at the label so i presume it's this it says 120 gsm satin finished paper acid and lignum free romantic roses 
So six A5 sheets, three of each, two new, two new unique designs. Theme designs. Oh, so I don't know if she sent me the whole thing. It does look like it. So these were when you um oh, not iris folding, tea bag folding. So these oh these would be beautiful in um, clusters. I'm no good at tea bag folding. But I would certainly use these. Oh, you were so naughty to send me a kit. That's really naughty. And the sheen on it. Oh, I don't know if you can see the sheen, but there's a beautiful sheen. So there's three sheets of the like tea bag ones, but I won't. I'll be using them in clusters. I might have to do some a rose theme ATCs, I think. And then these have got this wishes with the borders so there's three of them so thank you so much yet again Jean you really are a little sweetie so thank you so much for that it means so much and thank you everybody else for watching and also um thank you to my new subscribers I have subscribed back um thank you for the lovely comments just thank you everybody who supports my channel it means so much and anybody that's brought from my Etsy shop as well, thank you, you know, just thank you. It means a lot. So thank you very much. Bye.